Hello everyone, my name is Esteban Gonzalez, and if you're like me, sometimes you wish those massage results you get from your favorite massage therapist last just a little bit longer. Well, in today's video, I'd like to share with you eight things you can begin doing at home today to extend the results for as long as possible. Stick around and I'll show you how. Coming in at number one on the list for ways to improve your massage results at home is proper hydration, friends. Yes, drinking enough water. Many of us struggle with this very thing every day. We tend to underhydrate, not drink enough water. And water is key. We are made up of mostly water as human beings. And drinking enough water will help you sleep better, increases mental health and stamina, increases organ function, increases your immune system's function. Overall, friends, it's vitally important, but especially for your muscles and joints. Yes, coming in at number one, drinking enough water. There's a reason for it. Make enough time in your day, especially after a massage, to drink plenty of water, and I promise you'll feel better and notice the difference. And coming in at number two, friends, is nutrition. Nutrition is vitally important for overall health and well-being, but especially after a massage, be intentional about what you're going to eat for the next 24 to 48 hours. It's going to help your body recover. It's going to help your muscles recover. Overall, things that nutrition are good for is everything. Food is life. It's like medicine. So make sure that you begin to intentionally make those choices that you know are going to be best for your body. And I promise you, you'll feel the difference. And number three on the list is adequate sleep. Sleeping eight hours a day is great for the majority of the population. Not everyone can do that, but you make sure that you pin out some time for extra sleep, especially after those massages, and it's going to make a difference. Your body needs sleep to recover. It needs, it needs sleep to be mentally healthy and whole. It needs sleep to be in better mood. It needs sleep to have full cell recovery every night. So sleep is important. Begin making it a priority if you haven't been doing so and you will feel the difference. And number four on the list is mineral or essential oil baths. Minerals like Epsom salt or other types of salts mixed in with highly potent and effective essential oils can be a powerful one-two punch in helping your body recover. Take some time out, plan ahead, after you get a massage, if you're not at a spa, go ahead and head home, take a nice soak, read a nice book, whatever you can do to calm the mind but also ease the body. Those ingredients are going to make an extra benefit and be worth it, I promise. Coming in at number five on the list is stretching and mobility exercises. Generally speaking, your massage therapist, occupational physical therapist, someone that you see for your pain is going to give you some exercises to do at home. You need to start doing them, okay? So when you do them, make sure you stick to that proper form, but range of motion and mobility, flexibility, these are the things that we're always trying to achieve more of because the more we move, the more lotion we have in our bodies, in our joints, in our muscles, that's the whole purpose, is to live well with full range of motion in our bodies for as long as possible. Get out there and do those stretches. Number six on the list equally is those strength training exercises. Now it's important to note that strength training should not really be done within the first 48 hours of massage. You wanna wait, but as soon as that time is passed, it is very beneficial and essential to get in some strength training. You're going to reinforce the benefits that you've received from the massage. You're going to strengthen those weak areas, correct things that need to be corrected in your muscles and your alignment, help pull everything back into place. Overall, our goal is, again, more mobility, more flexibility, overall movement throughout our bodies for as long and as healthy as possible. Coming in at number seven on the list is foam rolling. Foam rolling helps reduce injury, increase range of motion, it brings more circulation to the area. It basically is a self-massage that you can do at home. Now there's many different types of foam rollers. There's different densities in the foam, different styles, different groups, shapes, and sizes. You find the one that's best for you and for your body, 
stick to a routine, try new things. I promise if you do that on a regular basis, add it to a routine that you do at home, you're going to see the results, you're going to feel the results, and you're going to feel better. And coming in at number eight on the list is percussion therapy. Percussion therapy is coming on pretty hard in the last four years or so. There's about a hundred different massage guns you can get on Amazon. There's two brands that I really I'd like to talk about. One is the Theragun, the other is the Hypervault by Hyperice. These are professional brands which professionals use, athletes as well. Use these guns, begin to understand how they work and how they're used on yourself at home. It's going to help reduce soreness. It'll help reduce that little thing called delayed onset soreness after a great workout. It's going to help bring circulation to the area. It will help break up adhesions and muscle tension. Absolutely, I promise it will extend the results of those uh, favorite massage you just received a few days ago. So begin to do these things, incorporate these things. Uh, top to bottom, I promise, go through that list, stick to it, begin to incorporate some of those things into your daily routine and you will absolutely feel the difference and extend those results. You'll be happier. I look forward to making more videos and seeing you around on the next one. Take care. Stay healthy.